Yeah, so uh, we're here at Start Stage 5 and uh, it's been a landmark day for the team today. It's the first time ever in the team's history that I've been part of that we've arrived at the start first. The reason why, we're a little bit paranoid. We got stuck in traffic last night. It took nearly two and a half hours to get to the hotel and uh, it is southern Italy. But unfortunately there was no traffic and we're here more than two hours before the start. Well, we've been here for half an hour and the first team's just rolled up. Yeah, yeah. But hey, in your room or in this beautiful bus, what's the difference? Uh, so yeah, thanks for uh, all the questions. Keep rolling in. Uh, another one we got in today was uh, favourite foods. Uh, Luca, what's your favourite fruit other than uh, strawberries? Oh, definitely my fruit salad, I guess. <laughs> no, just joking. I think my favourite... <laughs> <laughs> I'll add the symbols for you, mate. <laughs> just joking. <laughs> and my favourite food would be a steak. Rare. Rare okay. steak. Oh, yeah. yeah. Fans wants to know uh, what car do you, do you drive? Uh, normally, I have one for Mustang for uh, 2008, and yeah. an older one from 1965. So Which is expensive, huh? No. Obviously, gets paid the big bucks, I reckon. <laughs> I, I bought it five, six years ago, and, and was cheap in that moment. Now, maybe it's a little bit expensive. So people want to know about uh, the roommates and how that works out. Um, typically it's not something that you specifically ask for. If you want a room with someone or you don't want a room with someone, a team like this, you can room with anybody. Um, I've had the, the enjoyment of uh, rooming with Yatesy, the Tour, a few other races last year. So uh, him and I we were a pretty good match. Just trying to teach him a bit of Danish here and there. Last year in Canada I was speaking to him for about two minutes and in Danish without actually realizing it, and then I thought he was just being an arrogant bugger not answering me. But then I woke up and I realized I was I wasn't really speaking any English, was I? Do you guys practice changing wheels or tires uh, when we're not at a race? So that when you're at a race, you're more efficient. No, we never practice this. We just do this like a instinct, you know, and it's it. Is that why you're yeah. slow? Yeah, I never was slow. <laughs> I didn't know. I, I try always to be fast, but. Looking very uh, slick. You look sharp. Ah, look sharp. We, you know why? why? You know where we are in here. We are in Sicilia, you know? No? You, you look like Bono. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> this is the reason. <laughs> so today we've got some climbs at the start, a bit lumpy, and then this last part here is pretty flat. But, um. This is probably the first time I actually looked at the profile. And when you've got such good teammates, you don't really need to, to stress yourself out too much about this stuff because I just follow guys like Chris. He looks at all this stuff and then he just delivers me to where I need to be. And finally, uh, yeah, we'd just like to send uh, our thoughts out to Zach Gilmore back in Australia uh, overnight. He's uh, got got a, an infection so uh, we just want to know that we're all thinking of you all the way from uh, Sicily at the Giro d'Italia mate. Uh, keep fighting and we know that uh, you'll be back fighting and, and uh, you'll be better and stronger so uh, all the best mate and uh, keep fighting.